The body of a persuasive essay consists of several paragraphs. Every paragraph needs to develop the thesis statement in your introduction. A body paragraph will have a topic sentence that introduces the main idea of the paragraph. It has the topic and what we call the controlling idea. On the one hand, the enormous monetary gains that sports people receive can be considered exaggerated and not well earned. This topic sentence begins with a connector on the one hand, suggesting that there are going to be several arguments in the essay. Once you've written your topic sentence, you now need to support that topic sentence with several ideas. These are called your supporting ideas. It's good to have two or three supporting ideas in a paragraph. For example, those who argue against athletes receiving high salaries point out that they do not make great contrib contributions to the development of society in the same way that scientists, doctors, teachers and even politicians do. Try and introduce your next supporting idea using some kind of link, as you can see here. It can also be argued that sports people work shorter hours than most workers, receiving large sums of money for only a few hours, sometimes only a few minutes work. And then your final point, again a connector to indicate that it is your last idea. Finally, the high salaries can also be seen as contributing to the excessive lifestyles of some professional athletes witnessed in frequent news headlines about alcohol, drugs and violence amongst them. And then, just to round off your body paragraph, have a concluding sentence that reinforces the main idea of the paragraph. Therefore, according to some, Sports people should not receive large financial rewards. Notice in the concluding sentence that it shouldn't be exactly the same as your topic sentence. That would be a little bit boring. But you can use synonyms. Yeah. Um, for example, exaggerated in your topic sentence becomes large in your concluding sentence.